Good evening, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to my evening news report right here on the Riley King Network. Let's begin. Take a look at this photo right here. Strong arm robbery reported at Concord High School football game. Concord police are investigating a child that reported being robbed during the school's first home football game Friday. Concord police are investigating a reported a strong arm robbery during Concord High School's home opener football game versus Bedford High School Friday at Memorial Field. At around 8.40 p.m., an officer working a detail at the game called for backup after learning about the incident. A preteen was reportedly robbed by an older male. The child was not injured during the incident. There are no weapons were involved, and it is unknown what was taken at post time. Officers received a description of the suspect from the victim and witness. The suspect fled the area on foot, possibly with up to three accomplices, according to Scanner Chatter, toward the woods and cornfields on the western side of the complex. Units were sent to the area and searched the Old State Police Radio Building, soccer fields along Clinton Street, and the Trinity Baptist Church parking lot looking for the suspect and the complies. Officers spoke to a number of people milling around the area, but were unable to confirm that any of those that were involved in the incident. At the same time officers were investigating the robbery, other officers were sent to the area of North Fruit Street near the Irving Circle K and Concord High School for a report of a large group of youth near the store. An officer was asked to head to the store just to make sure everything was okay. There were no further reports of any problems in that area during the evening. At the same time, police at Memorial Field also received reports of other fighting in the area of the woods behind the football field. The incidents are still being investigated by police at post time. According to Concord Monitor, CHS football dispute playing hard lost the game 16-0. That does it for my evening news report right here on the Riley King Network. I hope you all have a great rest of your evening. I'll see you back here tomorrow for another news report. Good night and bye.